Hey everyone, welcome to Atlas Gaming. I release content every day. Today we are playing State of Decay 2. Love it. Love this game. Uh, unfortunately, well, I'm going to talk for a second here. If you don't want to hear it, that's cool. Just fast forward. But uh, what I want to talk about is uh, some things have happened in the game between the last video and this one. And I wasn't able to record them. The reason is something happened in my computer. I don't know what happened. One day everything was fine. The next day this game, I could not play the game and record it because of uh, performance issues. It was really choppy in the recording and uh, frankly it sucked. So I, I just decided to scrap those videos. And uh, now we're here. Hopefully everything's good after reformatting. If you don't know what reformatting is, it's literally uh, uh, erasing all the information off the hard drive and reinstalling everything from scratch. Uh, that's Windows, games, uh, recording software, everything. And so... I had to do that. It was kind of a bummer, but at the same time, it's always nice to have uh, a fresh start on the hard drive. It's basically like uh, like when you got your computer and it was brand new. Everything runs smoothly and quickly. Load times are fast. And then after, uh, for me, it's after three months. It starts to get all bogged down, but for most people, it's after a few years. Anyway, Poncho started a fight due to this low morale. Okay, so we got a bunch of stuff going on. We're going to have this like huge influx of missions, I feel like. Anyway, we're here. We're going to select this mission right there. You. And you can actually see across the street. Hang on a second. I already saw the dude. I know this mission pretty well. I've done it, I've, uh, I don't know, three or four times. See, see the guy over there in the building across the street at the snake room? The snake room bar and grill. That doesn't sound very appetizing. Like, I, like if I were driving by, like if I weren't from this town and I were just like driving by looking for a local place to eat, like on a road trip or something because I was tired of all the the uh franchise fast food places i wouldn't stop there because I, I don't want i don't want to eat snakes anyway let's talk to rob sergio screwed up again <laughs> well i can't i can't i'm just gonna say it normal i can't do maintain that voice the straight face he went out to scout but he's gone too long can you help us find him sure i could find him Good. no problem rob oh robbo all right i'm getting started robbo bobbo so he's like, he's literally across the street. I'm glad, glad I spotted him while I was talking because this makes it super easy. We'll just come over here. Hopefully that zombie doesn't hear us. He totally hurt us. Okay, well, it's just one. Wait, what? Yes, they are. They're right. I, we just saw him. Who's in the building then? Hang on a second. Hang on, hang on. Okay, so I'm not sure if you heard her, but she said, that's a shame they're not here. Who's this guy? <laughs> Who's that guy? Hello? Hey, it's Sergio. It's the guy we're looking for. Hey, come here, will you? I'm not going back with you. They don't care if I live or die. If you come back with me, I can talk some sense to them. Okay. Um, I see your point. I can help you get out of town if that's what you want. What do we want here? I okay. I'm not a big fan, just like in real life. I guess I'm gonna role play with Mia here a little bit, but it's not really role playing because I'm just like being myself. But um. I'm not a big fan of, like, forcing people to do things that they don't like to do, right? Like, everyone has the freedom to make their own choices, and when you start subduing people physically, that's no fun. But, um, okay, so if you come hey back guys, with me, I, found a few when I, was out. I can talk some sense into them. Okay, so that's kind of a compromise, right? It's it's like a it's like a half-win, half-win. It's not a win-win-win. It's, it's a compromise. Or we can say, I see your point. I can help you get out of town if that's what you want. That'll involve us lying. It's a lot of chatter in this game, isn't there? I guess it's single player. You got to fill the silence and make people feel like um, they're they're part of something bigger. But I see your I see your point. I can help you get out of town if that's what you want. So that involves us lying. Yeah, we're gonna play Mia the liar. Okay. I like how you think. Oh, cool! And we got another quest. What What do you need? Obtain one rucksack of food for Sergio the Apprentice. What about the snake shack or the Oh, Firehouse Tavern? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, no, that's not... Yeah, it is. That's where we are. Firehouse Tavern? Hang on a second. Hang on. Fact checking. That's not what it says on the front, everybody. That's the steak room. Okay. Well, that's all right. That's all right. We'll uh, get a pass. Get a pass because it doesn't matter really, right? Uh, jer Jester's Jerk Chicken Shack. I want to go over there. I've never had jerk chicken. That's, um... It's like, it's like a seasoning, right? It's a like Creole or something. I'm not. I'm not sure. Let's check in here first, though. Don't care about noise because we have some backup parts. Cool. Where else? Where's that other container? There it is. Oh, it's not a can. Okay. Well, it's, it's a table. I guess there are crates on it. There it is. Perfect. 
It was literally in here, Sergio. Not very good at looking, are ya? Chop off the head, get him! I'm about to drop. I hear... Oh, maybe not. Never mind. I was just gonna say, I hear more zombies, so I was like, kind of spinning the camera around to look for them, but... Mm, they were gone. It was just the ones we were fighting. Here you go! You are a lifesaver. Bye! Tell yeah, Rob about... Tell Robbo about Sergio. Tell them I'm dead. Oh, of course. I love this. Oh, gross. That's a child's swimming pool. What was someone doing with... Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. What do we have here? As long as that plague heart is I think we're good. Nope, Sergio's gonna handle him. Oh, that's a horde out there in the street. See it? I got complacent for a second. Well, Sergio's... Maybe, maybe if he dies, we can take his rucksack full of food. Run, Sergio, run! I'll help you out. Okay, there we go. Okay, back to the trailer full of, like, toy cars. What's going on here? What's going on over there? Jeez, there's all kinds of noise. I have a feeling we should get out of here. Oh, it's a bloater. He got the bloater for us. Anyway, it looks like someone's, like, hauling a bunch of toy cars out of town like they're looting, but, like, they're looting the wrong stuff. Hi, Robbo. How did it go? Did you find Sergio? Sergio's alive, but he's not coming back. You've been terrible to him. There we go. <laughs> he's uh, gone. Taken by the zombies. I hate it when folks just walk away like that. Well, maybe you should be nicer maybe to people. Maybe I was too harsh. Yes, maybe this you were. This project will be a lot harder shorthanded. Is he going to ask us to find somebody? No, he says take it easy. Ah, We're done. 200 influence. I'll take it. Is there anything left in this? No, we already searched this place. We found uh, the toolkit that's in the, in the trunk here. Okay, so what else? Oh, the free citizens med meds, please. Um, okay, there's a building with probably meds right there. Let's go over here and get this. Where is it? Right there. It's a, uh, it's a plague heart. We have six grenades. What else? We got some noisemakers. Yeah, we'll be good. Honestly, I'm I'm not a fan of doing plague hearts with just a crossbow. It's really slow firing. Oh, look at Sergio. He's okay. He's really gotten in, gotten himself into a pickle, huh? There's another bloater. I wonder if NPCs like that can just keel over, like taking too much damage and they die. Okay, let's have a peek in the window. Plague Heart's right over there. See it? Back there in the corner. Oh, the Snake Room Bar and Grill. They got a they got quite the establishment over there, don't they? Like, they've got a, a truck with tables on it. Hmm. Just have to get this done. That... It'd be kind of fun, but I think the novelty would wear off pretty quickly when you have to, like... Hold your food and drink to the table, or else it's gonna fall off. You know what I mean? Like driving around on a truck, on a truck trailer, uh, eating your food. It'd be kind of cool, I think, at first, and then like you wouldn't be able to eat unless you just like use your face, because everything would go fine everywhere. Okay, we're gonna go back here. Let's go close the door first. Give ourselves a fighting chance. We don't we don't have enough room for all the stuff we're gonna get here. That's okay. Can We'll set up an outpost. Maybe we'll get this Plague Heart and this Plague Heart right now. Okay. Uh, throw. Fire in the hole. Oh, look at that. That would be a strike if we were bowling. Boom. That really hurt it. Okay, how many more grenades? Okay, good. Plague nice. Plague Heart destroyed. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna hold off on searching that one, though. Oh, shoot. What was that? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Boom! Eat it, feral. Okay, so I guess... I, I think it's pretty safe to assume we're gonna get a feral every single blood heart or plague heart that we take out. Okay, where's that one? 194 meters? We're gonna get in the old car and then drive over there. Please hold! Okay. We're actually... Okay, here we go. Here we go. I think I think this is... Yeah, there we go. Thread the needle-ish. Not really. But 
Okay, we're gonna stop here, get out, and let's run over here and crouch. Hopefully that was enough distance between us and the car. They, they don't spot us. You don't know me, but I'd appreciate it if you'd come and hear me out. Blood Plague Doctors. That guy that was just talking on the radio. I'm not sure if you saw, but he was with the plug Blood Plague Doctors. I'm guessing he's going to have, like, some special items, like, uh, throwable items and stuff bloater. like that. We'll... Need to take it down before it gets too close. Oh, bloater, where is it? Oh, shoot, it's inside. There's a bloater inside. Oh, I'm so glad. Mia, you eagle eye. You rascal, that's awesome. Love it. Because if we would have been inside there with the bloater exploding, that, it would just be bad, that's all. Oh, maybe it's not inside. I really, really, mm, we only have three grenades. I really, uh, okay. Honestly, I'm kind of nervous right now. We got a lot of zombies around. Oh, missed that one. How many bolts do we have? Ten bolts? That's enough for this mission. For this task. Okay, four influence. I'm guessing that's just for, uh, killing enough zombies, you know? Like, it just kind of keeps a tally on each person who's... I have no idea. It's all speculation. Doesn't matter. Okay, hopefully... Gosh. Hopefully there are no more zombies in here. Um, let's take some pills. That's all I have. Uh, painkillers. Like, uh, they, they restore health magically? <laughs> I, don't, I don't understand it exactly, but, um, they do. They restore health when you pop enough of them. I'm trying to clear this place, just make sure, like, we're not gonna get unwanted visitors. Because I kind of like to just post up in the corner like this. Where is it? It's right inside there. We're gonna go into this room over here. Where there's no way out. And get the grenades. Okay, aiming right about there, right? Huh. One. Please work, please. Oh, no! Okay, no, that... We got it, we got it. Nice. Nice. Very good. Love it. Okay, so that's both... Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what's going on here? She's taking a ton of damage. Why? Did I... I wasn't patient enough. That wasn't a ton. I thought it was going to last longer. We're good, though. What the heck is this thing? Is that... Okay. Oh, oh, bye. What do we have here? Okay, we got the rucksack for what? Oh, that's right. We got the quest. Nice. Love it. Um, What else can we use here? Oh, B. B, you butterfingers. She, um, so she's got a thing. Here, let's look at this. She's got a thing. Where is she? B, right here. Uh, she has a trait. You can see the red one. Uh, reckless. Don't overthink everything. That's how this world gets you. Sometimes wastes materials. So she just wasted some. That's okay. I think, I think we're gonna be okay. I think we'll be alright. Okay, combat knife. Do we want that instead of, no, we've got this awesome police knife. Do we, do, do we need... We have some of those in the uh, in the car. Eh. We're, we're going to come back here anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Look at that. Look at this. The place is all clear and free of the, uh, the plague hearts. We're going to go over there, and we're going to... Claim an outpost. Do we run? No, I don't think we should be running. She lost a lot of stamina. I'm not, I'm not sure what it was from. Maybe it was just sprinting. Maybe... Oh, you know what? No, you can see it. There's an injury. Let's look at her. Um, I and come over here. Oh, bunch. Bunch of things. Gas inhalation. What? I didn't... I didn't know plague hearts gave off a gas. Okay, good to know. I mean, obviously, something bad was happening, right? She was, like, suffocating when we ran in that room. I couldn't control her. It was kind of chaotic. Oh, I thought that was a screamer over there. It's not... Oh, there's a... There's a juggernaut, though. See him? He's huge. He's taller than the fence. He's like... If Andre the Giant gained, like, 250 pounds in just pure fat... Oh, no. Oh, I thought he was just, like, running over here at us. Okay. 
They're okay, so th we we're playing State of Decay 2, but this is uh, more specifically the Juggernaut edition. Those guys are why. That's the Juggernaut. And every single Juggernaut has the Blood Plague. There'll be a time when we kill all the Blood blood Plagues in this game. And then, um... It's been a while since we talked. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, no, we got you. We'll kill all the uh, the Plague Hearts. It'll the, the, the map will stop spawning um, Plague Zombies. But, like, we'll still see Juggernauts and they will have the Plague. Anyway, that's a pretty obscure detail. Okay, we're gonna go in here. Nope, get away, get away. Um, is there, can we uh, just open up the other door? Yep. <laughs> I love that. If you stop and wait a second and just think about things, it's usually pretty easy. Site not secured. Oh, we just have to go in here. Boop. No more creepers. Cool, so we're getting this outpost because it's 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 ammo. We can start, we can produce more ammo. And we can shoot things. Um, confirm. And then, oh, we have 831. The looking good. Yeah, hang on. That said... A little more effort here could really pay off. Yeah, no kidding. Upgrade ammo outpost 2 plus ammo income. Learn chemistry. Beauty. So it costs a little bit of materials. It costs manpower. That's the person with the shovel. And then uh, 800 influence. And we have, what do we, we have like 831 or something. I have one of those weird juggernauts out here. Oh, nope. Bye. I'm exhausted. The juggernaut will just rest. ruin us. I mean, like, I, we don't, yeah, we don't have what it takes to kill the juggernaut. Oh, when it starts screaming like that, that's that's not good. Okay, we need um like a 50 cal. I I don't know. I'm sure people who are, who are watching this who have played the game would argue with me, but like in my experience, we need a large caliber weapon, um like an automatic shotgun or semi-automatic shotgun, uh a 50 cal, 50 caliber rifle. That's that's a half inch um, diameter bullet. It's huge. And then um maybe like some explosives or just like a lot of people shooting at it in the head. With small caliber weapons like um like 762 or 556. So we got that one, cool. And then okay, so where's our car? Is it is it no, it's where did our car go? Oh that's oh I forgot I left it over there. Okay, that's fine. Uh we have 1.3 kilometers. Where's the car? There it is. So we have to go back through the juggernaut. We have 1.3 kilometers in the to our right. To go drop off this med sack or the the rucksack, the meds rucksack that we're carrying. So we'll get the car and go drop it off. See, this car's way better than than that truck, I think. It's just fast. I, I've I've explained all the reasons. I don't have to go over it again. I think it's way better. Um, and yeah, like the the game's pretty well balanced. I think like for mostly. Right, like some vehicles have better things than others, but then they also have worse things than like, you know, making the same comparison with the same car. But no, this one I think, um... If I take out the nearest Plague Heart, this should clear up. It's better, and, and regardless, yeah, like regardless of the balance in the game that I think exists. Let's go over here. Almost there. We actually have two bags of meds. We have two rucksacks. With meds, they only need one, though. Wait, they're, they're in a hospital? What? They're in a clinic, and there's the pharmacy that we didn't explore because we found three rucksacks in this... Okay. <laughs> That's all right. But sometimes this game is funny like that. Okay, who'd we talk to? This person? Oh, after they're done... Okay, shooting things. All right, green vest, Zip. Her name is Zip. The free citizens. Look, I get that we're not exactly friends, but we're desperate for meds. Can you help? I, you, you are beyond help. I think at this point, if you are in a medical facility and there's uh, a pharmacy right next door, and you can't find meds, you are beyond help. But anyway, <laughs> I suppose we can help you out. Give one rec sack of meds. Done deal. One hundred uh, influence. Pretty sweet. Now they're friendly. Now we have the free citizens who are friendly. You know, let's let's look at this for a second. Oh no, you know what? We don't have time to look. Let's go back here. Zombie thread at home. We have eight and a half minutes about to get over there. Oh, thanks guys. <laughs> they might not They might not have the brains, but what they lack there they make up for with gunpowder. Or uh gunfire. Guns? Ah, uh, that didn't You get it, right? <laughs> the choke 
the joke is there, the framework is, I just, the delivery was, it failed. Shift, shift. Can you hear that thing revving up? It's like redlining. There you go, there you go. We're almost there though, so it doesn't matter now. And parked, there we go. That part left, it says parked. Just kind of like waiting for that to happen so we can use the parking space like this. Um, we're gonna, okay, we're gonna leave this in the car. Drop these. We're gonna use this, I guess, right now. How, no, mm -mm. no, we're not. We got an AK. What we need are suppressors though. We need quiet weapons. And those, and do we have, how many bolts do we have? I wonder if we have enough bolts. We're not letting any of those monsters inside. Oh, do you oh, hear me? close the gate. Turn off the light. And let's go, um, while we're waiting, let's look at this. Uh, I guess not. No? Craft items. Oh, produce ammo. We can make bolts right here. What does it take? Three materials? Jeez, okay. <laughs> that just seems, like, steep. How many bolts do we get? Oh, we get 30 of them? Okay, I guess, I guess so. I guess so. So we'll make those. Fill up our bolts right now. Where are the bolts in the thing? Um, go here. There we go, 39 bolts. Perfect. Can we shoot through? Oh, God, totally missed. I, we, we won't know from that shot. Get out there, Mia. She's getting tired. We're going to leave her here after this. I need a rest. Get right behind you! Sergio! Oh, no, that's fuzzy. Close the gate over here. She's super tired. But, yeah, we're going to leave her here after this siege because... Well, she's tired. That's why. I think we've... Actually, let's just go over here real quick. Let's get this guy. Get him. Whack! And let's look at this. What's her standing? She's a hero. Yeah, she's done. She's she's like max standing now. Just burst through the fence and then get a melee kill. That's the that's the main reason that we took Mia um, over anybody else, like over the new recruits to the community, because uh, we just we wanted the standing with her. Oh, that's you, B. Get her. Get her! Beetle mallet! Cool. The creepers are gone. Let's just make sure everyone's okay. Are we all okay? I don't know. Alright, Ramon. Cool. Got a couple things done here. Let's see. Oh. What a okay, I guess we have three infestations around. Hmm. How much ammo do we have? Let's look at this. Uh 237, 556 five, rounds. Yeah. Oh, no, I don't, I didn't mean to take it. We'll get that in the next video. All those investigations, because that's it for this one. This game is called State of Decay 2. I love it. Um, I'm really looking forward to the update that's coming out. No. No, wrong game. I, I play so many games, I got it mixed up. An update for this game was just released. I was thinking of World War Z. I am excited for that update later this year, uh, 2021. But anyway, thanks for watching Atlas Gaming. I release content every day, and we'll see you in the next one.